up, dude? They say this city used to be like any other city when it was on the ground 500 years ago. But after losing to Solaris, they launched just the palace block of the city up into the sky. It's basically an unbelievable story, but in reality, we're riding on that part of the city and floating out in the sky right now. In life, you never know what to expect. Hello, nurse! Back in Kislev, I used to deal with homemade medicines. By the way, I've heard rumors that the enemy has some really cool medicines. I wanted to learn some of those techniques, so I snuck into their shop, but I was a little clumsy. <laughs> I got desperate, and somehow managed to escape and make my way to Thames, the city I had heard stories about. That's where the good people here picked me up. If they hadn't picked me up then, without a doubt, I would have been a guinea pig for their experimental drugs. Because I'm so cute! Um, no longer hello, nurse! So where did you fellas come from? From the looks of it, I guess you're from the Ignis continent. Are you saved by the people here, too? I understand. We're all in the same situation. Everyone's got their unique story on how they involved, how they got involved in this fiasco with the Gubbler and the Ethos and all. The usual pattern here is that many of the people were almost eliminated for some reason they don't know. But we're saved by the people here before they were doomed. Yeah! Even if I were to return... Oh, sorry, even if I were to have returned back to the land, they would probably try to capture me again. It wouldn't matter how many lives I had, it still wouldn't be enough. So I've decided to stick around here. That's probably the case of for the majority of the people here. Anyway, don't you want to make the bad guys pay for it? They gotta be crazy if they think we'll just take this lying down. Well, there goes one of my ideas. That's basically it. From now on, we're all on the same boat. Welcome aboard. Thanks. Kind of. I think I've talked to you. Yo! This house is basically an apartment for us land dwellers that were saved. I heard that there aren't many pure Shivites in this town anymore. Basically, it's been said that a majority of them were lost in that war with Solaris 500 years ago. Well, if we're not careful ourselves, our fate may be similar too. Ha! <laughs> That's hilarious! Just get out of here. I assume this all leads to the same spot. No, there's a way down. What is down here? One dude. What's up, one dude? Yow. Who are you? A new face? Don't scare me. I was wondering if there are drinks in here. Are the higher up still planning on fighting with some country called Solaris? Aren't they the scary guys who actually control the world from the shadows? They're the Illuminati. This is crazy. Just when I thought I was able to survive. I can't take it anymore! I need booze! So, apparently, no, there is nothing down here. So, let's go ahead. Jump on the elevator? Really? I have to jump? To just run on? Damn! Look how small that thing is! Whatever they've got going on, it is, it is nice. Okay. Wow. Seriously? The dog knocked me off. Where's that dog? I'm gonna kick his ass. What's up, dog? Dog. There we go. That dog is huge. Look at that. It's taller than Faye. Damn. Never mind. I will not mess with that dog. But there's something in here. I had to jump to get here. There better be something. Freaking jumping puzzles to get to a city. Um, hello and welcome! As you can see, the deep sea bros is open. It's just that we aren't doing any business right now. Um, K? Anything on the jukebox? Insert 20G. K? The Valley of the Wind. That's, that's kind of nice. I'm not gonna... It's like 120 G that you want me to spend on that. Can I can I talk to the men in pink? No, seriously, can I talk to the man in pink? I gotta sneak up behind him. Look at these birds. They have forgotten how to fly during the long history of evolution. 
We humans are the same. We threw away our broken wings and forgot how to fly. But I doubt it will end like this. We'll remember the sky again, someday. Running into the deep, vast blue sky forever. The day will come again. Don't you think so? If I say yes, will you give me something? Damn you. Alright, fine, I'll waste my money. What else do we have? A distant promise. Yeah, we've heard that one. It's a it's a nice little lullaby. Lost screeching shards. Oh, all the emotional music is pretty much what we're getting here. Our village is number one! Oh, this is the original... Original Layhand music. I like this. We wounded follow the light. Oh, sweet. It's the organ music for when we were in uh, Nissan and, and when we first got here in Shavat. What else do we got? The strong seek dreams. That's the only one that's not capitalized all the way through. Dun, dun. I think this one's my favorite, actually. I like this one. And I think it's because it's from Final Fantasy VII and I just have nostalgia for Final Fantasy VII. So, it looks like we're done here. Nothing to do in the bar. These jumps don't seem to be normal. I don't know, maybe... Maybe I'm just paranoid. But I don't... Like, yeah, I can't make the jump if it's offline, so... There's something with these jumps. But don't tell me you're like Satan version 2.0. Wh what are you doing up here? Why do humans hate and hurt each other? Everyone lives under the same blue sky. Will there ever be any relief from the pain of losing what was precious to us? When will it be? The day we can understand what all this loneliness and sorrow was for. In short, we may be repeating the same mistake we made 500 years ago. So we got Captain Philosophy up here. Can I jump down? No. They're gonna make me... At least I don't have to jump down. I can just run, but they're still not letting me really go down. Okay. Where is I going? Yes, around this way. Down the stairs. Work with me, camera. And then in here... What do we have? Oh my god. Oh. This is utter bullshit. That's what this is. Ha! <laughs> Who would have figured? Oh my god, what have I done? Oh, man. Um, there was a rumor that the secret room of the Sage of Savat is hidden somewhere in this town. I wonder if it's true. All rumors are true. It's an RPG. What? That's strange. You smell like soil and trees. Yes, you do. Long ago, the Choo Choo tribe lived in the woods with no interference. Yes, they did. There's a Choo Choo tribe. I wonder if someday we could ever return to the land and live in the woods again. Oh my god. Okay, that looks just like Choo Choo. That one up there. Fine, you want to walk up and talk to me? What's up? Say, I have something really good to tell you. I could let you in on it. It's a deal you can't refuse. Do you want to know? Yeah, sure, why not? You want to know? Yes, yes, you do. Alright, I'll tell you about the inspirational tradition of the Choo Choo Tribe. Yes, I will. Long, long ago, the Choo Choo Tribe had a great big guardian god who could step over huge mountains in one step the wondrous mambo god yes he was the, oh my god they worshiped the dance the choo choo tribe and the wondrous mambo god lived happily together in perfect peace yes we did a dreamy sweet existence but one day a huge red fireball rained down from the sky and blew away our guardian god as he was asleep bam kablam boom 
Don't worry. The great big guardian god became a star in the sky. He protects the Choo Choo tribe. Yes, he does. Yes, yes, it's a great story. No matter how many times I listen to it, I'm so moved. Yes, I do. Be careful now. Remember, bad guys that pester the poor Choo Choo's will get punished by our guardian god. Yes, they will. This, this probably won't end well for me. What about you back here? Wait, did I just talk to the wrong person? Like, seriously? No, no. You want to listen? What? No? You don't want to listen? Are you sure? I see. Too bad. It really is a great story. Yes. Yes, it is. So, apparently I can't talk to the, the orange one back here. Oh, there we go. I hear the sage and Savat did some research on the Choo Choo tribe's tradition. Yes, he did. It's a lot of work. Even the old generations of the Choo Choo tribe don't remember many things about it. Awesome. They're so beautiful. These are wonderful things that nobody else sells. Yes, they are. But this is a very important treasure of the Choo Choo, so I can't sell it to you! Sorry! Please go to the counter if you'd like to buy something. Thank you, thank you, of course. Wait! What you have in your hand is... The Mythical RPS Badge! The Legendary h &S Badge! The Tag Badge! Even the Maniacs are crazy about! Yeah, I've got all the badges. This is a complete badge set of... A GAMER! I'm so amazed, it's great! Yes, it is! Want to exchange the three set with our treasure? It's a deal, yes it is. Do you want to exchange it for Choo Choo's treasure? Pretty much since that's the only thing I can do, I'm going to go with yes. Here it is. What do I get? I get a Charger A. A Power Ring S. Okay, Power Ring S is not worth it. Not worth all that effort. What is the thing that you gave me? Where'd it go? Oh, well, I do have the gold bullion. Should sell for the high price. What was that? Spiderweb. I never did use that. Um, where? I've already forgotten what it was they gave me. Damn you. It was a Charger A. So it's gotta be, like, an equipable item, right? Charger A. What the hell is a Charger A? Is it... Is it something on the gears? Or just nobody else can equip it? There we go. A charger. Charge restores 50 fuel. 